Well, hello everyone, and welcome back here to Akiba's Trip. This is episode number four, I believe, but every time I say something like that, I get it wrong. So we'll see. It's probably episode six. <laughs> At this point, I've stopped caring, to be honest with you. I'm here with uh, the wonderful April. Hello. Hi, thanks. And between the two of us, we are going to mangle many, many accents and do embarrassingly uh, weird translations of these Japanese people, these obvious Japanese people. <laughs> one of whom sounds like Russian, one of whom sounds like a, a, a strange Scotsman, even though she's wearing a maid's dress. <laughs> and, well, it just goes downhill from there. <laughs> I don't think we've done an episode of this without breaking into uncontrollable laughter at any point, so uh, you're probably going to get about 15 minutes worth of this, plus about 5 minutes of this giggling, so I hope you don't mind that. <laughs> so, let's crack on! Alright, so last time we, uh, we, we, we found, we found the, uh, the, the comic cafe and we, we've met half a dozen other people. Which, fortunately, as we're just recording this one straight after the last episode, we can actually remember what they sound like, more or less. Mm -hmm. And we found out that um, our waif-like vampire girl is, in fact, a runaway. So let's, let's see how the plot hots up. Yeah. I, I didn't run away exactly, and I do have a place to stay. It's on your couch, <laughs> asshole. Give me a key. <laughs> Every single male in the uh, in the, uh, the the place, including Pops, is thinking, "You don't have to stay on my couch." <laughs> a place with plenty of manga. They even have a shower there. Don't tell me you're staying in a manga cafe. Do you not have anywhere else to go? Mm, seems you've got some heavy stuff going on. Uh, that dress is hiding it, then. <laughs> Pops, you know, upstairs is a stark and bare and empty. Oh, I'm Scottish, I love it. <laughs> hmm? Oh yeah, you're right. And I think we've got some petting squirreled away around here, too. What do you say, she's cool. If you like, you're free to stay on the second floor here for a spell. Stay a while and listen. <laughs> <laughs> and we won't. Oh, if, there's, if there's a peg leg fetching quest, I'm going to be very amused. <laughs> and we won't. Uh, we won't take no for an answer. Meeting you like this feels like it's going to be more than a coincidence. You know what I mean? She wants to get into bed with her as well. Okay. Yeah, let's just oh. all orgy. Orgy. Oh. Having you around can only be for our benefit if we're to continue studying these monsters. It would seem to be a win for all parties. Yeah, we can dissect you instead. Hmm. Ah, then we agree. The Akiba Freedom Fighters have a new member. Three cheers. Bob. <laughs> But wait, I haven't agreed to anything. Ah, oh, that's all right. We agreed for you. <laughs> uh, okay. Ladies first. Um, please for me. Um, <laughs> puppy dog eyes. <laughs> <laughs> all right, just for a little while though. Thank you for having me. She's like the other place has like a hot tub. And they feed me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, definitely short straw drone there. <laughs> okay, so here we freedom fighters stand in the midst of a maelstrom. Well, there's a few female strums in there as well. Yes. <laughs> Not a she. You said you fought some of these things already, but aside from that, you ever done any real hand-to-hand -hand combat? CQC. <laughs> okay, I was forged in the tire fires of Toko's Wrath. I can hold my own in fighting games. Well, I can argue with the best of them. <laughs> yeah, that one, I think. No, actually that one. I like that one. <laughs> I can argue with the best of them. 
No, I'd say in the realm of verbal combat, you fail a bit short. Fall a bit short. Sorry, that looked like a knife. <laughs> yeah, your sister beats you there every time. See, I'm getting a little worried now. Hey, I know. A friend of mine runs a coliseum in Akiba. Or a battle arena, I guess. Whatever you want to call it. This voice is so fun to do. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there's a coliseum where we can actually have some of these characters getting naked and sweaty. Yeah, so, uh, moving swiftly along. <laughs> Might be a good place to get yourself caught up on the basics of combat. You want? I'll introduce you. For real? What kind of person is this? Who the hell runs a battle arena in Akiba? Just some martial arts nut I know who found herself managing the place, that's all. But she doesn't like when just anyone step in the, into the ring, so you gotta pass some kind of test first or something. I'll give her a call and let her know what's up. So you better get going, Nanashi. Oh, and take Shizuku with you, too. A little extra training can't hurt any, right? Unless it, like, undoes all of her good training. Mm. Uh... I think Toko should go with. She could probably force your way in there with no problem. Test be damned. Watch your tongue. I am a dainty and respectable lady. You got that? Seriously, rude much? And if you disagree with me some more, I should punch you repeatedly mm -hmm. in the face. Her secret agent name is Molotov Cocktease. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a bad idea, though. So whom will you escort to the arena, Nanashi? She's a good Toko. Your turn. That's up to you. Um, no, 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 no. It's your turn. This is this is why we add the chaos, a little bit of chaos to it. <laughs> Do you want to take Cotty? <laughs> Should we? Sure, that's funny. Huh, you want to go with me? I guess I can drag along, but I can't fight, you know. All I can do is headbutt someone. All I can do is cheer for you, Nanashi. The battle arena's on the other side of Main Street and right past Junk Street. So, let's get to the pedal and go. Knock him dead. So I can get to the battle arena through Junk Streets. Changing partner. Okay. You can change partners by talking to the person you wish to accompany in Mogra, the Ever Living. Always be sure to select the most suitable person to your desired ending, as your choices will contribute greatly to the story's conclusion. Yeah, I knew there was going to be a dating sim in here somewhere. Mm. Ah, do you have a moment? <laughs> I was wondering if there's anyone you have your eye on. I'm fairly perceptive in matters of the heart, so I can tell you that the many girls in your life think of you. Please feel free to ask me for an update any time. Okay, as you continue on your journey, the conversation choices you make will determine how you're regarded, which in turn may affect the story's outcome. So be sure to check back with me from time to time and always think before you speak. Well, you should have said that. Eh, it's alright. Okay, so... Let's hit a few buttons. Okay, that puts labels over people's heads. That's not the button I want. Mm. That one is the map. That's not the button I want. I want to save. And we got lots of messages or something like that. Yeah, you gotta go to a cell phone. How did we... That, there we go. Alright, so let's save first. It's because I enjoy saving so much. <laughs> save. Saving. Oh. Feels so good. Ah. Oh yes. So whatever. Oh yes. So he got something on Pitter. <laughs> okay, start with the emails. Come straight home. No details from uh, details from Nanny Nana. Everyone's worried about you. I think you should come straight back to base. Don't stop off anywhere. Not even to pee. You go wee all the way home. Sorry. <laughs> 
Ahoy hoy! It's your arena manager, Antoinette. I'm looking for spunky warriors to fight in my arena. Ooh, but those who consider themselves grapplers or just want to score some winning, step right up to my open air arena. You know the one. I'll be waiting for you. Let loose and open the floodgates of your desire. And no, I'm not talking about those floodgates. Oh my. Mm. Yeah, there was no innuendo in that, was there? Yeah. And Pitta. Pitta is a social media tool that's open to the public, though some days you wish it wouldn't be. Helpful information pops up on Pitta from time to time, so be sure to keep an eye on it. No. <laughs> okay, so. Ah, I'm the only one in your freak out. Blah, 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 blah. Oh. Oh, it starts at this end, doesn't it? Yeah, I think it starts at the top. Yeah, it started at the top. It started at the top. Okay, that makes no sense whatsoever. Probably really later on. <laughs> Akiba Foodstuffs. Hey, everyone, where'd you guys go for food? And lunchtime is the best. As a lone girl, there are lots of places I'm afraid to go. Nobody asked you. Okay, this is... Yeah. Do you think they give important information? <laughs> You're like, no. <laughs> um, encyclopedia. Alright, okay, so, right, alright, yeah. There you go. Yeah, it's just bits and pieces at the moment. New stuff. Nothing new. Light Otaku. Like to help. You've only start, started taking interest in anime and game subculture. There's a hobby to nothing more. Okay, so. Noob. Yes. And character profiles. That's probably going to be good the next time we try to remember the voices. Alright, okay. So. We need to go. We need to go follow the exclamation mark. But should we have a quick run around and talk to people first? Sure. The arena, you think a champion will be there? Yep, that was useless. Mm. Oh, I see, this is this will actually choose her. Oh, yeah. Well, let's talk to her because we want to uh, have her along anyway. <laughs> she says to go fight. Yeah, she actually said go fight! <laughs> Alright, I'm not going to talk to any of the girls because I don't want to go through that. Yeah. Uh, song and dance routine and oh dear that's can't that go to that's, the that's room. painful can't go to. that's painful oh you can't go to the men's room either yeah. no partying for you yes. not allowed how are we doing for time we've got about uh six or seven minutes okay she's got a plate yeah that's her weapon oh that's so cute I was thinking, why is she blue? But it's the clothes she's wearing. Okay. <laughs> Alright, I'm thinking we should be beating up people, but I don't quite know who to beat up yet. I notice that everybody's got weird weapons mm. in the backs. Yep. I think that at this point they might want you to follow the story. I'm not sure. Well, I don't know. I think we took we'll sort of more take the story and pervert it into our own area, mm. don't we? Pretty much. Um, yes. At the very least, pervert it, yes. Hmm. Foreign tourist. What's this place? Um, I guess that's where they want you to go. No, actually, where we want us to go is over there, but it looks like there's a couple of bits and pieces we can go into. Hmm. I love how you can shove people. <laughs> okay. okay. You, young lady, take all your clothes off. <laughs> As opposed to a fake Akiba flyer? <laughs> 
Oh, and I, I keep it fly. It might be something like a Glasgow kiss. I don't know. I don't know what that is. A headbutt. Oh. <laughs> Oh, lots of places you can go in. Yeah. Uh, I keep it. Keep it. Ooh. <laughs> right, let's try this one. Sure. Shopping. There are various shops all around Aki Harbor. Items, weapons, clothing, and even food can be purchased from these places, so if you should ever feel so inclined, you might want to go on a little tour of the town and see what's available. Welcome. Okay, so... We get a plastic bat, which apparently is good for Nanashi, but bad for Cat Catty. A keyboard, which is good for both of them. Actually, that is quite impressive. A comparison, a monitor which is good for the. How much money do we have? We have ten thousand. Mm -hmm. So we could actually get that. Um, can of ramen. It's ramen in a can. The noodles are made from cognac. When eating, you feel a bit tougher, but only as long as you remain in the immediate area. Uh, shorts guide contains techniques on removing normal shorts. <laughs> when red, your shorts normal strip skills will slightly increase. <laughs> <laughs> latest OS from DSP. The latest OS exclusively from Dospara. Very few computers can run it, though. It's uh, so it's pretty cheap. When used, you will feel you can learn a lot more within the area. And a Geiger counter. Almost sounds like an attack. Geiger! But really, it just detects radiation. When used, you'll feel luckier within the immediate area. Oh yeah, I'm not feeling the urge to buy any of this. We might, I suppose we should get the bats. It's a cheap upgrade, by the way. What do you think? Um, yeah, I mean it's not too expensive, and yeah, you can try to get more money out of people. Hey, uh, oh, there we go. We've got to get. We've got to select a quantity we buy. So we'll buy one. Okay. All right. Um. Okay, so let's see if we can remember how. Hmm. Right, so item, a change, of, change of equipment. Here we go. Uh, the boxing gloves had two, and that had twenty. So yeah, yeah, that's a definite improvement, isn't it? You can afford the shorts guide. I mean, is that something you'd want to get because it'll make it easier to remove? I think we should get it because it's fun. <laughs> oh, welcome. <laughs> Okay, so uh, shorts guide. Oh, hold on. Yeah, I thought I did that. Okay, so uh, we got two thousand eight hundred. Okay, and sell sell these boxing gloves. There you go. Okay. Hmm. Oh, there's durability on these items. Okay. Yep. All right, so yeah. items. Yeah. There are three kinds of items, two of which, excluding story war relevant key items, can be sold for money. Some marked as usable items can be consumed to grant a temporary boost to your stats. So, short sky. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so use shorts. Normal experience has been increased. <laughs> <laughs> you could have done this game. <laughs> Get out of way. Oh, sorry. Oh, it's oh. like I just read this thing that told me how to remove shorts better. I feel so good. <laughs> oh, shop. What's this one? What's this one? Um... Oh, it's food. Yes. Get out of the way, I'm a man with a plastic bat. <laughs> so, a stamina bowl. Where hey? A salty stamina bowl. You <laughs> can <laughs> say, excuse me, do you have any chocolate salty balls? <laughs> um. Oh, what the hell, this pickpocket. Sure. That was probably the most stupid decision we've made in the game, but she's saying an awful lot, really, isn't it? <laughs> so we got 
Nice, nice. So, shop there. Oh, it's on the wrong way. Whoops. Oh. I think it won't actually let me go. Uh, oh, it's because. I see, but it's because uh, if I go off the map when it's not a plot device area, it actually lets me choose on the map where I want to go, which is interesting. Hmm, mm, very serene. Look at this place. Ah. Um. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> I think those dead eyes say it all, really. Well, now it's rare to get customers at this hour. Hmm? Oh, you must be the boy Pops was telling me about. You look rather ordinary to me, but perhaps there's more to you than meets the eye. Oh, where are my manners? I'm the manager of this establishment. You may call me Antoinette. Well, I don't own the arena. The one who does is presently on a journey, so I'm in charge for the time being. Now then, let's get started, shall we? This facility exists to help one achieve his or her full potential. It is a place where rivals cultivate each other's growth. Those who win do receive reward money, but the true reward is the experience itself. <laughs> However, not everyone has the heart of a champion. If you wish to stand victorious within this ring, you must first prove yourself worthy. I will now test that worth if I may. Are you ready? Uh, oh, I don't think we have any choice, do we? Which this is going to overrun a little bit, I think. But uh, okay, let's do this. I accept. Let's accept your challenge. Hey. I'm rooting for you, Nanashi. As you wish. Please step into the ring. Fight! I believe in you, Nanashi. You can do it. And this is where I had desperately tried to remember the, the combat controls. Hmm. It's been about six weeks since we played this game last. Mm -hmm. Cutty here. If you fight these vampire synthetal enemies, enemies, you'll be, need some kind of special skill to defeat them. But I know what that skill will be. But I know you must have one locked away inside you, and I will cheer it out. Okay, so immediately after stripping an article of clothing, you have a chance to keep your momentum going. If the durability of one's foe's adornment is below a certain threshold, a button prompt will appear on the game screen, indicating your eligibility, eligibility to strip a game instantly. Ooh. Press the corresponding button before the prompt disappears, and a second article of clothing will be removed. This may be followed by yet another prompt, and yet another and another. These are the default controls. Yay! <laughs> So it's like cleave. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, that hurt. Oh god. Alright. <laughs> Got him! Oh, I can do all the others as well. Nice. Oh. 
Okay, that's that's the power of random mush button mashing. People. Yeah. Yay. <laughs> On the status screen, when your defense is high, you can deal more damage to your enemies. When your defense is high and your clothing is less likely to be ruined during combat. No. <laughs> hey, more weapons. Yeah, let's grab everything. Okay. Okay, when your strip combo soars very high and the world around you begins to fade away, when the last timed button press you can now perform a strip mm. finisher. Ooh. Removing the enemy's underwear via a special cutscene, and the underwear doesn't tear easily, so it'll be there for the taking out <laughs> Do I really want to know? I don't want to know. Well done. Though, considering who sent you here, I shouldn't be surprised. You were simply amazing. I might just be in love. And I'm so glad you chose that voice. <laughs> you didn't great, Nanashi, really well. Here's your pass. With this, you may come you make use of the arena anytime you wish. Please make this Coliseum roar with the flames of your passion. Mission complete. Come on, let's go back to Mogradi Ever Living. <laughs> Guess I should head back and tell Pops how I did. At the Battle Arena, only the strongest can survive. If you've gotten the hang of this, you might want to try facing some tough opponents to see how you do. <laughs> Alright, is there anything left on the ground to pick up? Um, some, uh, turn back towards Antoinette. Is there something? There you go. There we go. There we are. Boxing gloves. They'll sell. And I think what that was that it. yellow thing that they dropped? Was it a purse? Oh, no, let's have a quick look. Items. Useless items. It must have been an equipment thing. Okay, so... Don't tell me you can't see it unless it's... A suitable item. So uh, we found another plastic bat, but that looks like that's pretty worn. Carty's head. Oh, where Carty's head <laughs> No, we can't. Plain t shirt. Was it a yellow parka that you got, maybe? Hey, it could have been. Um, stained parka, that one. Yeah, it could be. It? Yeah, there's, there's a pink one that says yellow parka that I think is for. Women. Yeah. Cathy's main uh, made flowers is better. Uh, yeah, it looks like we got the best one on there for a man, doesn't mm -hmm. it? And same. Oh, the pants oh, there are better. So. It's... Yeah. Oh. There we go. And ordinary sneakers. Nothing there, nothing there, nothing there. <laughs> oh. Like, I want to wear her underwear. <laughs> uh, we won't let us change oh. her yet. That looks up. Boo. Okay, All right. Okay, guys, I think we're going to end it there. I'll tell you what, let's do one last save. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. 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 Let's save it, actually. Way. Hey. <laughs> okay, um, well, I think we've got about ten minutes over on this now, to be Whoops. honest with you. And uh, it's probably best to end it there, because it's midnight, and I've got to go to work in a few hours. <laughs> 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 so, everybody, I hope you enjoyed this. Please do leave a like if you have liked it. Please leave a dislike if you disliked it, to be totally honest with you. And tell us why in the comments. Mm -hmm. Whether you liked it or disliked it, if you haven't, please think about subscribing, because my ego demands it. So until the next time, thank you very much, April. Oh, thank you. And thank you, everybody, and good night. Bye.